I S U P K. Hey, Salam, man. It's Priest Kevin in Doha with the I S U P K. And the Commander Johnny Yahana in California, man. It's like all blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians. Subscribe to this channel, man. You want true salvation? You gotta learn from the priests and prophets of the I S U P K, man. Subscribe to that channel. Hit that button, man. And it's there with that. Salam. All I ever wanted was to be a gangster. Little did I know I was in danger. Decisions that I made provoked the Lord's anger Pray to him all the time, but I was just a stranger All I ever wanted was to be a gangster Little did I know I was in danger Decisions that I made provoked the Lord's anger Pray to him all the time, but I was just a stranger All I wanted was to be a gangster And shot call To be known with them niggas letting shots off Either that or the right hand to the top door Funny how we see vanity and not the lives lost Can't be focused on a life that's hopeless Out there pumping, not knowing the Lord will kill you for that hocus pocus Used to roll with niggas that cook dope with weaponry Same ones claim they love you, I had your life in jeopardy And I know my mother won't success for me But that G should take a girl straight to ecstasy I heard what you said right there, right? I heard what you said. You, you said. you said what we're preaching is dangerous without action. No, I want to ask you. I, could, could, I, could I ask you a question? What kind of action we talking about? Give me one second, brother. Let him answer. Just, just let him answer. What kind of action we talking about? What, 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 I'm asking you. Uh, we didn't say we didn't say we want to. You're not listening. Let, let's let, let's get let's get let's get it again. Let's get it again. Listen, when America, let me ask you something. When America soldiers go to war, is that is is what they do their personal desire, or is what they do the desire? No, it's not. No, it's a check. And their actions, their actions are dictated by somebody who is in charge of them. That's how a military works. That's how a family works. That's how any organization works. So now, what we say is not our desire, it's the desire of the man we serve who is over us. Our King Jesus Christ said, and let me finish brother, I ain't cut you off, let me finish. He said, whoever enslaves his people they are going to go into slavery. The reason we're telling you this is because you never heard it in your life. Right. So now, once again, I'm asking you, you said to, to be preaching this without action is dangerous. What sort of action are you talking about? I'm do I'm putting action to it. I am putting action behind my words. I'm saying God is going to enslave white people. That's right. God is going to burn America to the ground. God That's is right. going to put them in chains. That's right. Now, the action, the, action I'm, the, the action I need to do is to stop sinning and serve God. That's the action. Now, what you said was right. You was absolutely right. Talking, the, the, the Bible said fake without words. I'm being real. The Bible says faith without works is dead. No problem. Uh huh. I didn't say we need to enslave white people. You are lying. You are lying. God said he that goes into captivity, that leads a man into captivity, must go into captivity. God said by a man's actions is his judgment. I'm not hiding behind the book. This book is my defense and my weapon. That's right. You are hiding behind America. That's who you're hiding behind. Because you know what? You really don't want to separate from America. Right. You, let me show you. Let me show you how you don't want to separate. Can I show you how you don't want to separate? You are American. You see, you're not American. That's where we at. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm not preaching propaganda. I'm not preaching propaganda. I'm not preaching propaganda. Let, let, let's, let's be real with each other. I'm not speaking propaganda. Well, you want to correct your statement. Or else, or else your question is propaganda. Well, to me, your question is propaganda. To me, your question is propaganda. No, so, no, let's, let's, let's read. read. Revelation chapter 13. No, no, no. I said excellence. I hear, I, I'm, I'm Exodus. You saying you're American and what I'm preaching is propaganda. 
But the white man put on TV this week that a brother stabbed another brother over chicken. Right. And that ain't propaganda. That ain't propaganda. The white, the, the oppressor went on the damn TV and called the Mexicans rapists and drug dealers. That ain't propaganda. But when I come out here and say, black people are the real Jews, the white man is the devil, you say that's propaganda. You are slave to America. Right. You are slave to America. For who? For who? But, well, listen, I, I can help you understand why that happened. I'll, ha I'll help you understand why that happens. Read. Exodus chapter 23, verse 22. But if thou shalt own... Let me ask you something. You just said you was American. What, what nationality was the people was who stabbed you? The people who stabbed you and shot you in the head. What nationality are they? Well, then we need to stop being American. Right. So we could now, now not be victims of violence and not be perpetrators of violence. You ain't seeing the problem. You got a veil over your eyes. You're not seeing the problem. I am making sense. If you're the victim of a crime and you're American, and the person who committed the crime is American, then obviously we need to stop being American. Right. But you boast American. You boast American. Go ahead. But if thou shalt indeed obey his voice and do all that I speak, what does that matter? Why are you preaching to me about my country? What does that matter? This is not your country. This is not your country. You fighting for a slave master and slave both of our parents. You fight. You not from here either, Negro. Where the hell you think you from? Where the hell you think you from? You were born in a plantation just like the rest of us. And listen, and this is the problem. You want to tell me what I ain't from here? Like you got some right to this land more than me. You ain't got no right to this land more than me. We got the same rights. We are children of slaves. Both our parents suffer under this oppressor. And you want to tell me you more you more entitled to this land than me? What the hell is wrong with you? My parents died too. How dare you say that? My parents died too. My parents suffered too. My parents were lit on fire too. But you love the white man so much. You love the oppressor so goddamn much. You would like, you would choose to separate me and you because you got an American accent and I got a British accent through the Caribbean. You want to separate me because of a language. You preaching propaganda. This land belongs to the Mexicans. Trump said, yeah, they don't belong here. You saying I don't belong here. You're just like your daddy Trump. Give me John 8 and 44. Give me John 8 and 44. Not you. Stay right there. Read. But if thou shalt obey. And you are because you are American. And you are because you are American. Because you're American, you're tough. Because you are American, you're tough. Why you not in your country? Because I don't have a country just like you. Because I don't have a country just like you. You this is not your country. This is the land of your So if you was born in the ocean, would you be a fish? You would be a fish. You would be a fish. You see how simple we are? You saying because you was born here, you American. So if you was born in Beijing, you would be Chinese, nigga. Bro, American, huh? bro. You would be you would be John for me if you was born in China. Huh? If you was born in, in, in Calcutta, American. India, would you be East Indian? You you, listen, where well, you're born does not matter. What matters is the seed of your father. And listen, I don't care that I'm not American, and that's a badge of honor. You want to be American, and that's the problem. Read. But if thou shalt indeed obey his voice uh -huh. and do oh, all that I speak. You asking for action? Let me see you do this. Read it again. Oh, but if thou shalt indeed God. obey his voice. Obey what? His voice. Are you ready to obey God? You talking about action. You want action. I'm an American. What has America done for you? What America has done for you? What has America done for you? What has America done for you? But murder your parents. Murder your brothers. Rape your women, set your parents on fire, and you, I'm an American, I'm an American. God damn America. That's right. Let Christ burn this kingdom to the ground and every Uncle Tom Negro with it. The hell you want to talk about I'm an American? America don't give a damn about you, Negro. America don't give a damn about your mother, your father, your children, your sister, nothing. But you saying what I'm preaching is propaganda. Your whole life is propaganda. Your eye hiding behind that, you hiding behind that plant in your, in your damn hand. That's why you're so passive to America. Right. That's why you're so goddamn passive. America get, gets you high and make you weak to the, to the oppression of your people. That's right. 
You listen. Say it again. Talk about motherfucking whites. Yeah. Put it Why you ain't mad at America gentrifying your neighborhood? Right now in the DC Council, they got a whole damn meeting about removing everybody from Barry Farms. They call it Barry Farms because a black man who was a mayor named Marion Barry wanted a place for black people. But you ain't mad about that. You ain't mad about that. You mad because I'm out here speaking against your lifestyle, which is because you want to be American. You want to lay up with all these oppressors' daughters and all these heathen daughters. You want to get high and you want to be a good American patriot. Well, love America when they kill Michael Brown. Love America when they kill Sandra Bland. Love America when they kill Eric Garner and Oscar Brago. I'm here because I love my people, that's why I'm here. I'm here because I love my people, that's why I'm here. I'm here because I love my black brothers, my Hispanic brothers, and Native Indian brothers and sisters. Why the hell are you here? Because you love America. You love America. Where I'm from doesn't matter. It's what I do and who I serve. Where you're born does not matter. You're a traitor and a sellout to your nation. You're a traitor and a sellout to your nation. If the white man gives you enough weed, you would pull your butt cheeks open for him. You're a traitor and a sellout to your nation. Read it again. But if thou shalt indeed obey his voice and do all that I speak. And do what? Do all that I speak. If we obey God, that's real action. That's action, obeying God. You want to obey America. Obey America for what? We obeyed them for 400 years and what have they done for us? Murder us, slaughter us in the streets, rape our women, kill our children. God gave me this microphone, Negro. God gave me this microphone. I will never give God's glory to another man like you, like you. The white man give you some shoes and, and a damn and a nice phone and some white woman to have sex with and you want to be American. I don't give a damn. I know if I know if good comes to me, God gave it. And if bad comes to me, God did it. Because he is my father, not the goddamn white man. That's right. You can go suck on the white man's rear end if you want to. Kiss it for you and for me. Because I ain't gonna never love this devil. That's right. I ain't gonna never love this white man. Because I ain't weak like you. Right. Read. I think it's be an enemy until and listen, let me tell you something. He was up here pumping Yang a second ago. You ain't tough, you ain't tough. I was weak just like you. And you know what? This Bible made me free, man. This Bible showed me how to put weed down. This Bible showed me how to conquer going in the damn strip club. This Bible showed me how to love my people and hate the oppressor. Hate the people that hurt mine. You love the oppressor because you want to reject God's word. Listen, I don't care. Listen, God, God said, my sheep hear my voice. If you don't understand what God's saying, you ain't his sheep. You don't want to talk about real shit. I don't want to talk about real shit. I want to talk about black people. I want to talk about Hispanics and Native Indians. I'm hiding behind nothing. I'm right here telling you the truth. You hiding behind America. Tell me one thing America did for you. Tell me what America did for you. Give me one. Give me one thing. Give me one thing America did for you. I don't even know where you from. Well, listen, if I'm not American and you are, kick me out your country. Where are you from? Take me now and kick me out your country. Take me. You said this is your country and this ain't not mine. Say that again. Wake him up. Wake him up. Wake him up. He sleep, right. get it, brother. I had. Yeah, right. You say, you say, you say, you say, I'm not from here, but you are, and you are American, and this your country. Well, Negro, kick me out of your country. Kick me out of your country. Kick me out of your country. It's your country. It's yours. Show me. Listen, kick me out of your country. You so simple. It's not your country. It's the country of your slave master. And you are property to this white man like the rest of us. Like the rest of us, you're property. The problem is, the problem is, while we running for the gun line, you like this. What about the gun line, boss? What about the gun line, boss? Boss, boss, they're running to the gun line. You know why? Because you're an Uncle Tom sellout Negro. You're too young to be a goddamn Uncle Tom. You're too young. 
and listen, ask these brothers, I most love like, the youth. Like I love the youth. culture of the youth so when everybody you hates it. But you this goofy, is old you as, as goofy, Judas. Trying to find something to follow Hand loyalty, every man tried to borrow Felt pain, and a lot of sorrow Got betrayed, so packed I didn't even have my heart broke Living confused, about to lose hope Cops got me on the side of the road Like a sideshow, need an antidote before I croak Now I'm setting fire to rhythm man blues Call this guitar smoke Rebel with no cause, trying to find direction The world got me vexed Picked up a bad lick of habit that's hereditary from oppression Felt like my life was on fire trying to find an exit Now look, 10 G's plus a good wreck Sometimes a follower is a soldier Trying to find a good shepherd Plus when you in hell, how do you excel? Wisdom the breath of life, I don't believe in fairy tale. Listen well to what I tell No call it can cause pain Something that a rebel knows very well can't you tell I was sent from the Lord? Got a tongue like a two-edged sword. 